In 2077, what makes someone a criminal? Getting caught. Duh. In Night City, you can become anyone, anything, if your body can pay the price. Yeah. Duh. Because before they put a bullet in you, you'll make this whole city burn. I have personally been really excited to give people a closer look at the gangs. We've shown a little bit on Twitter, but their styles are so distinct. Yes, I enjoyed them a lot as well in our game. I think they're very cool. But let's start then with the kind of role that they play, because gangs really do play a prominent role in Night City, correct? Yes, definitely. The gangs, they rule the streets of Night City. You know, they have the newest cyberware, they have the newest weaponry, and they are really a power that everyone needs to take into account when they are thinking of operating in Night City. You will encounter them as you explore the city, of course, but also as you complete main quests, side quests, uh, different jobs for the, for the fixers. Uh, sometimes you might even get hired by them. But then, I suppose everybody's thinking then, can you join a gang? Well, V is a merc, and mercs of Night City are this unique, distinct group that stick mostly to themselves, right? And they get jobs from a variety of factions. They can get jobs from corporations, they can get jobs from gangs, they can get jobs from uh, different kind of like influential clients. Because of this, nobody will ever trust a merc to be one of them, right? So, and the gangs are no exception here. They are looking only for like people that they know will be loyal to them, right? And that they will fight for their cause all of the time, not just some of the times when it's profitable to them. So because of this, V will mostly stick to the afterlife. And the afterlife are this group of mercs, this legendary group of mercenaries in Night City. They get the best jobs, they get the most money, the best clients and so on. So if you want to become a legend in Night City, you are going to the afterlife. So we've obviously mentioned distinct style then. So does that mean there are kind of special gang themed weapons and items and clothing for players to find and use? Yes, definitely. There are different vehicles that you can drive, for example. There are cars, there are motorbikes. Um, then, of course, there are different uh, pieces of clothing uh, themed after gangs. Uh, there are weapons and so on. So yeah, definitely there are things to look forward to. I suppose as somebody who's spent as much time as you have kind of getting to know the gangs, I have to ask, which is your favorite and why? <laughs> so I would have to say probably Maelstrom, uh, simply because they have this unique, distinct feel uh, and this weird aesthetic about them. So the idea about Maelstrom is they are people who want to cross the boundary between the machine and human, right? They are changing so much of their body with cyberware that they no longer look human, really. On top of that, they are also very unpredictable. Uh, it's very difficult to say what they will do at any point when you meet them. Uh, at one moment, they can be shaking hands with you, and at the other moment, you know, they will pull gun out, gun out on you, and they bring in this element of chaos into the game, which I really enjoy, personally. Oh, Matty, thank you so much for joining us. It's always interesting to learn what uh, your favorite gang is. I think it kind of tells me a little bit about you. <laughs> oh, does it? <laughs> what does it say about me? <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll talk about that later. Wake the fuck up, samurai. We have a city to burn.